Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Alhamdulillah. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. Amma ba'd. We ask ourselves the question, can we have success without kitabillah wa sunnat rasul sallallahu alihi wa ala alihi wa sallam? And of course, if we're truthful with ourselves, we know that all success is from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And it is in following kitabillah wa sunnat rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Even though we see people in various aspects of the dunya, in status, fame, wealth, all the other joys and delights of this dunya, but we should never be deceived. Don't be deceived by the dunya. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, the dunya sijinu mu'min wa jannat fil kafir. This life is the paradise of the disbeliever and the prison of the believer. The Prophet ﷺ said in an authentic hadith, in, in the dunya, halawat al khadira wa in the Allah subhanahu mustakhlafukum fi fayandru kayfa ta'malun fataqu dunya wa taqu nisa fa inna awla fitna bani israil kana fi nisa the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said verily the dunya is like a beautiful garden and Allah establishes you upon it and he looks to see what you will do so fear this worldly life and fear the women, for verily the first fitna, the first trial that befell the people, the children of Israel, was the women, was the fitna, the trial of the women, which is a big test for many of us. The test of wealth, the test of women, the test of fame. All of those things are things that can deceive us if they're not put in perspective, if they are not used to worship, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala meaning that if you choose a wife then she's a righteous wife that calls you to good if you choose a husband then it's a righteous husband who commands you to good and encourages you to do good those are the things that a believer is looking for for success in this life and Kitab al-Sunnah will give you that it's all in there but most of us either don't know or we have weak tawakkal Allah, Allah. We have weak trust in Allah that Allah will rectify our condition and our affairs and our state and help us and assist us and that He is able to do all things. Have Allah. All this is from Allah. All this is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's creation. So know that for sure. Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi raji'un. From Allah this came and from Allah it shall return. And to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala it shall return. We came from Allah, and to Him we shall return. All of this dunya will leave the beauty of it and the bad of it. This is by the decree of Allah. So it's important for us to never get attached to it. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us from becoming attached to the dunya and bless us with khair. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.